So let's say you wanted to build a popsicle stick bridge. Here's a tip how. Triangles, you probably know, you've probably heard that they're very strong. And this is explaining why and how to use them. Now, the red arrow that has just been put at the top shows the first pressure on the triangle, the compression. The two on the sides also show compression and the two at the bottom tension. That means that the bottom bar is being stretched in the direction of the pink arrows and the two on the side are being pushed in the direction of the red arrows. This means that the weight is distributed evenly around the triangle. I will demonstrate this using magnetic rods. Here we have a triangle. I'm pressing very hard on the sides and it doesn't break. So that means that it is perfectly strong. It is distributing its weight evenly. Now let's try with a square. As you can see from the start, it's very flexible. So that probably means that it won't distribute its weight evenly. Yet we can try fixing that problem. Just by adding one bar between means that instead of having a square, I've got two triangles. That means that it will survive much greater weight. Yet, of course, if you push too hard, it will break. Now, let's try with the blue pyramid. This has four sides, four triangles. That means that it's, strong, that it's very well distributed. The weight goes through the three rods sticking up to the top point, and that means that you can press very hard on it and it won't break. Yet, of course, if you hit it, it will. Now let's try this with a cube. A cube has six sides, each of which are squares. This, as you can see from the start, is not going to work. Just simply by letting go of the cube makes it break. Now let's see how triangles are used in very famous architectural works. See the Eiffel Tower, there are, you might say there are squares, yet each square is four triangles. And on some of the squares, the triangles are even more triangles. It's triangleception. And this means that the weight is distributed evenly. Even the entire arch of the, of the Eiffel Tower is a triangle. Here we have the Wembley Arena. The circle around the top is a triangle. The arch around the top is made up of triangles. They're everywhere. And the architects know that this is a strong choice. So that's why I recommend this in popsicle stick bridges. Here we have one I built. There are triangles everywhere. There are triangles down the side that are reinforced. There are triangles down uh, on the bottom that are reinforced. As you can see, there are squares, but with a diagonal crossbeam that reinforces the triangle. So, thanks for watching. Hope you found this video useful. Please check out my other two videos that I've got right now, Brandenburg Gate and Combustion Engine, and see you next time.